and welcome back to the unboxers and today we have for you from the legend series shang chi and the legend of the ten rings this Death is dealer. Dealer. this is the final figure in this series or this wave um and i really thought this one was gonna um skip by us <laughs> yeah because i have not this the when i got him was the first time i've ever seen him in retail yes so um, he has eluded us from the uh, normal normal. He has eluded us from the normal places that we um, purchase them. So, um, but it ha was awesome to find the Death Dealer to complete the build for. Yes, for Mr. Hyde, whose foot you can see over there in the. Yes. <laughs> like, I finally get finished. <laughs> He's been waiting for his left arm. Yes. So um, let, oh, so let's take a look at him in the box. He Whoa. is a cool figure. He's he a cool very looking. cool. Um, look at the details on him. Yeah. Amazing. Um, very, very detailed figure. And you see that hand? Arr! And then he's got extra set of hands with, um, looks like some weapons. Yeah, um, it looks like these are he's throwing. Oh, and yeah. And in his hand. Okay, so I was trying to get the one. Yeah, I can see that the one. That's pretty cool. I have never seen hands with that. Yeah, actually that before. is cool. I like that. Um, so, um, and then there's the set that we did. If you would like to see any of the others, we did we did them all. Yeah. Up and this is the last one. So number four of this, um, and this is the guy we're doing, um, the Death Dealer, to get that final piece, which has number four, the left arm. So um, these are, of course, by Hasbro. So, we're going to go ahead and get the Death Dealer out of the box and give you a much closer look. We'll be right back. Okay, and we're back with the Death Dealer. Yes. With Death Dealer, that's the <laughs> Sounds like a talk show. <laughs> we're back with Death Dealer. <laughs> Anyways, let's take a, take a look at his extra set of hands. Okay, so this one has like where he's like about he's to throw the knife. Throw, yeah. yeah. So, like you were... Um, throwing it from the sharp end and then it flips end over and look at the detail that's really cool and uh six in the board right yep that's what he's doing he's throwing throwing it at the lady spinning on the board yep. <laughs> anyway uh, then we have two that have already come out of his hand uh they almost look like they're shooting out of his finger but i think i see what you're doing he's throwing them the two of them and so and these look like well i don't know they could be same size as the other one but that's a pretty cool effect. Yeah, they Hasbro has, has really done some cool like little effects like that. Really. Right. Um, and then let's take a look at. No, oh, do not look directly into the can. Ooh, oh my gosh, look, he's staring at you. <laughs> that is super creepy. I did not realize. Let's see if his eyes follow you. Oh no, they stay that way. <laughs> So it definitely looks like they're posed to look at you that way. When I did that, that was super creepy. And then, um, so he's got detailing um, around his, like the different um, fabrics and etchings. Um, what am I trying to say? Uh, like the mask? Yeah, the different um, <clears throat> textures. Oh, oh, oh. Textures yeah. is what I'm trying to say. Um, and then he's it's got, got like the top knot. Top like knot. A, like a ponytail. samurai. But look at this detailing around the collar here. This is super impressive. Um, and then you have this fabric. Um, and then you have... Do they, oh, these will come out, but that's cool. So it's the same type yeah. of knives that you have in the other hand. So that's where they are when his hands are empty. They're back here. Yeah. And then, so you have his uh, arm arm armor. <laughs> oh, yeah, like gauntlets, but, yeah. Yeah, there you go. <clears throat> Looking for the right word. Um, and then he's got some... Tassels. Cool tassel. Uh, detailing there. Uh, let's take a look at the front. So he's got this detailing all the way down, which I find super impressive to that tiny detail. Yeah. Um, he's got really cool detailed belt as well. And um, this is giving me like Cobra Commander vibes. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. The, silver and the blue. The, yeah, it really is. <laughs> but um, anyway, so and then he has a slit right here so that he can um, he can has a little have a little bit more range of motion. Um, and then there's his super cool boots. Um, I think he looks really cool, especially, whoa, that's the angle. <laughs> all right, uh, take it away, John. Show okay. off his articulation. So let's see, all these Hasbro figures, um, they have pretty much very similar um, articulation, but they are really well articulated. Um, and one thing is, is it's very, all of it's very smooth. So 
he can go side to side, if you go, you can look down, up, you know, kind of Tilt tilted head. a little bit. Um, he has like a full range in the shoulder, like he can go up all the way around. He has like the bicep uh, swivel, double elbow so he can get a really good bend there. Uh, and you know the uh, the wrist will pivot as well as bend, so you can do some cool like martial arts poses with his hands. <clears throat> Let's see. He has like the uh, waist articulation. Um, I don't. He feels like he does have like the the ab crunch, but um, with this it it yeah. might be a little hard. To get it to do it, but it it does feel like it's wiggling, like it does yeah. actually have that that articulation point. Um, yeah, actually, if you hold the <coughs> the mm -hmm. um, the tunic or whatever, then you can actually uh, yeah. make him yeah. go more. So that's pretty cool. Uh, he has like the mid thigh or upper thigh, the double knee, and then of course the ankle, and it will bend as well as twist so these are always really great to pose and they always look really good so there is death dealer all right and now the moment you've been waiting for we've completed the build a figure and it uh, is mr uh, hyde look mr. i've got two hyde. arms <laughs> it's like i'm coming after you with this one <laughs> um so there's a mr hyde um uh, obviously he has ooh, he has really good head articulation for such a big head yeah um, I was going to see, he's got uh, shoulder up to this point. I didn't know if we had showed off. He does look like he has like a, oh, I guess it's a single elbow, yeah, but think, it's on a ball joint it, and can. Yeah, I think some of these have, like they do differently for these big figures. Um, in, instead of like the mid, like the bicep, like the, uh, the shoulders, I mean, not shoulders, the elbows will twist as well so you can get more range of motion there instead of having the. Yeah. So the, the elbow pivots instead of the the arm. And then cool. his uh, his arm will do this. I mean, his hand will do the same thing, and you can see the other joint. He can move it like that as well. Um, his suit is a little bit rubbery, but not. You know, it's kind of hinders him through the midsection. Um, but and then he's got that upper thigh, mm -hmm. like you always talk about, and he's got the knee, which I think the knee. I'm trying to see. Well, maybe the knee just has a bend in it because he's such a, a big guy he's probably yeah. going to be standing and then he does have some ankle but I love those shoes yeah wing tips or something so cool yeah and these big figures are always pretty cool um you know they're Ooh. they are a little <laughs> um they're a little uh less articulated um but the but, size of but them yeah I mean they're just massive I mean you can see they're about the same size now and you know and death details. dealers <laughs> standing on a pedestal so. yeah that's really awesome. All right, so there's Death Dealer and... Mr. Hyde. The finished, complete Mr. Yes. Hyde. So thank you so much for watching. As always, come back and see us. Like, subscribe, and we will see you next time.